Today is a great day for all of us. That's our friend Denna, and she's about to take part in the Boston Marathon. This will be your first Boston Marathon. What are you expecting? Um, for the people that run it, the marathon is more than just a race. It stands for something so much deeper. Sacrifice. Pain. Resilience. And triumph. Have fun today. Good Thank luck you to you guys. Much. But seeing Dunna here, it means even more. Enjoy! It's only been 15 months and here she is doing something pretty incredible. Yes, there's tragedy. However, it's not the end of the line. It's not the end of life. It can't be. In Boston, the hockey community has always been very close. It's where I first met Denna. I think I would say I was always a competitive person. I always played team sports growing up. My dad played hockey, so I think um, hockey was instilled in our household when I was really young. Dana really likes being on a team. I think she likes having people's back, and I think she likes it when people have her back. Having a good team means everything. You can go far with a really good team. In 2015, we went further than any of us expected. Our team, the Boston Pride, were playing in the very first season of the National Women's Hockey League. We were invited to play in an exhibition game against Le Canadien of the Canadian Women's Hockey League on hockey's biggest stage. Obviously, the Winter Classic itself is huge. It was just a huge, huge day, a huge game. I could just see it on our face when we were in that locker room. We were all taking pictures and photos together, saying how ready she was for the day and how excited she was. It meant a lot to both of us to play our best hockey that day. I think it was everything we had wanted it to be and more. So it was in the first period. I had had a couple shifts and I wasn't too happy with the way my previous shift had gone. I was racing for the puck and I kind of got caught up with one of um, the Canadian players and I went into the boards. I couldn't feel my body, I couldn't move my body. I felt really cold. I just couldn't move. It was a somber and frightening moment at the Winter Classic. A woman living out her dream, now facing a long recovery. Denna Lang is described as the ultimate team player. Devastating accident left Denna Lang paralyzed. Denna's neck was broken. They told her she might never walk again. Denna's injuries, I mean, it's such a tragic thing to ever happen. We knew we had to support each other through this time. Boston! The team always had Denna in their minds and in their hearts. From the moment I got hurt, they were so supportive. They were in the hospital visiting me. After that moment, we were battling even harder for each other. For the win, shoot, scores! Hillary Knight wins it! She's there with us, kind of a sense, was just, you know, something extra that was in her heart that lifted us up. Thrown it from backhand shot, she scores! Three nothing cry! They went on a big, long win streak. All those girls were just like, we're doing this for you, Denna. We're not gonna stop. Um, they were really great, you know, and they really helped her. Two seconds to go, time runs out, and Boston takes the Isabel Cup. They win it for their teammate, Denna Lang. One of our teammates went and grabbed her phone right away and FaceTimed Denna. 
She was crying, and I might even cry, actually. Her <laughs> I'm gonna sing on the, the moment. Even though I wasn't on the ice, they made sure that I felt every part of the team. The team's work was done, but Denna's was just starting. Break that barrier to get to level, level three, the dreaded level three. When I first got hurt, I took one day off. I'm off. I think it's about that time. Bump it up a little bit. She's in here every day, five days a week, uh, you know, either th two or three hours a day. She spent a lot of time in the gym, you know, training for hockey. It's not that much different here, it's just a different goal. She's crushing She's ready for this. She doesn't back down, especially when the fight is as monstrous as moving again. At first, she couldn't even hold up her head. And now she can sit up by herself. Her core strength is getting stronger. She couldn't really move her arms. And now she can. Watching Denna push herself so hard made us wish we could help. But we weren't sure how. That's when a friend of Denna's family came up with a wonderful idea. Former NHL player Bobby Carpenter is teaming up with Denna for this hockey dream team. Bobby had texted my dad and asked if he could push me in the marathon. I didn't know whether she was physically able or healthy or wanted to do it. After a few discussions, we decided it was something we wanted to go forward with. The big goal was to raise enough money to help people, to be able to help her have a chance to do more rehab, to have a chance to walk again. Perfect. For a former NHL player like Bobby, wanting to be a part of this was just so amazing. Not only for Denna and her family, but for us. It meant a lot. Denna and Bobby raised over $77,000 towards Denna's rehab facility, Journey Forward, and Spinal Cord Research. But for us, the marathon wasn't only about raising money. It was a chance for all of us to show her she would never be on this journey alone. Bobby Carpenter and Denna Lang are inspiring, no doubt. I think what Dennis taught us mostly is you can't give up because she's not giving up. As much as we wanted to encourage and help out Denna, I think she did it way more. She's determined to do what she wants to do. We're just following her lead. That last little stretch right there was madness. The crowd was so loud. I don't cheer very often, but in this moment, it was different. They're there cheering me on. I haven't seen Dennis smile that big in a very long time. It was, it was awesome. Bobby Carpenter crossing the finish line. Big smiles there. I never expected the support that I've gotten in such crazy amounts. Denna, you're the most positive person that I know. With an indomitable will. The greatest spirit. A contagious smile. We will forever be behind you on this journey. Keep on going, girl.